What is up, YouTube? Spectacular Spider Grandpa coming back at you with his new comic book day books. I went to the antique mall, got some antique books, dollar bin books. Um, I got another Philip Tan, I think that's his name, exclusive. And I got another Funko Pop. Um, before we, whoa, before we get started here, I want to do a special shout out to, uh, a young lady that I've known on YouTube for uh, a few years now. Met her a couple times. And of course, that's none other than Cat Run Figures. Uh, she turned me on to a show uh, called Shark Lords. Uh, I found this show on Hulu. I don't know if it's different for wherever you guys are at. But um, you guys know I love sh uh, sharks and shark movies and shark everything. Um, you'll see some comics with sharks on them today i got my jaw shirt on but uh shark lords man i started that last night and uh i'm not gonna spoil it for you if you love raunchy comedies that make no fucking sense but it's i don't know it's funny i was driving in the car a few minutes ago and you know just laughing thinking about the shit go check it out it's uh funny um so cat Ren, thanks again um gonna watch some more tonight uh we'll be finishing warrior nun uh real soon i think oh, god damn, i'm spitting all over myself but uh let's go let's get these two exclusives out of the way um or uh one's not an exclusive it's just a variant of the child that i call it the deep throat edition um and that's him with the frog in his mouth so pretty cool his legs hanging out um how do we know that's a frog? Is it a frog? I don't remember. Um, but anyway, uh, I had to have this one when I saw it. The other ones are pretty uh, boring, in my opinion. Uh, I have the, the original, I have the giant size, and now I have it with his frog in his mouth. I think there's like one where he's using the force, um, but uh, I don't think I'll get that one. I'm drooling on myself again. What's going on? Talk, thinking about them goddamn sharks. Um, and this is the KRS Comics, I think. Yeah, KRS Comics, uh, uh, Philip Tan exclusive Venom number 26, right there. Um, awesome cover. Uh, I'm, apparently I'm a big fan of Philip Tan because I keep getting his, uh, his covers. So, uh, got that. Uh, new comic books for today that came out today. Um, not a whole lot I picked up at the comic book store. Um, we're going to run through these real quick. Uh, Darth Vader number three. I knocked a, a, a soda bottle uh, over and Kylo uh, has um, confiscated it. So he'll chew on that for a little bit. Uh, great cover here with uh, Vader and his wife Padme. Uh, let's see here. I got the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles annual. I think this is the Eastman cover. So, I just realized that's Kang or Krang in, um, I think that's Leatherneck. I'm not sure. I could be wrong in his body. I don't know. We'll have to give that a read and a review on Blaster Stash It. Uh, Spider-Man Noir, number two. It's been a while since I read the first issue with all the COVID nonsense going on. But, um, we'll, uh, take a look at that one. Love that cover. Kind of a black and red cover. Um, Amazing Spider-Man 45. Um, uh, starting that Sin Eater storyline. Uh, independent book. I think this is my only indie book for this week that I have right now. One of eight, Lost Soldiers. So, give that a read. My only DC book I picked up was, uh, of course, Grandpa's Gotta Have His Squad, Suicide Squad number seven. Picked up Cuckoo for uh, Cable Puffs, uh, Cable number two. If you don't know what I'm talking about, uh, come check out Blast of the Stash. We're always having a good time on there. We talk about cable puffs and um, all other kinds of good shit. Uh, X-Factor number one. I'm a big fan of the original X-Factor team. I'm slow, slowly but surely completing that run. I might have some more in that uh, dollar book pile. But this is the new, uh, new X-Factor, so I picked that up as well. 
that is it for new books. A lot of uh, Empire tie-ins this week. Um, not crazy about all that stuff, so I left those on the shelf. So I'm um, going to get some bags and boards on those. And my big stack of antique mall finds. Uh, nothing in here is going to be worth millions of dollars. Mostly uh, just run fillers for myself. Um, got about 50 books in here, I think. Or I can't do math, so we're just going to run through them. So right out the gate, well, they're falling over all over the place. Uh, I got Punisher uh, number 17. Uh, Catwoman number 9. Right there. Catwoman number 12, part of the Night's End storyline. Uh, Catwoman number 90. A lot of Batman stuff again. Um, Detective Comics 641. Batman number 544. Got the demon on the front. Big fan of the demon. Um, I found this. I don't know what it's from. I haven't done any research on it. It's a little mini comic. Um, it looks like it came with a record or a cassette tape. A special MPI audio edition. The Untold Legend of the Batman. I thought it was pretty cool. I grabbed it. <clears throat> if you know anything about that, let me know. Uh, Battle Chasers, number five. Batgirl, number 57. There. Found this. I don't know if it's rare or what it is. It's a Back to the Future, Untold Tales and Alternate Timelines by IDW. Uh, number one. Uh, big shout out to the great legend. Uh, so I grabbed it. Why not? Uh, Batman 500. Uh, part of the Nightfall stuff going on with the horrible art on the front. Uh, Detective Comics 665. Uh, here's one of them shark covers I was talking about. My shark porn. Uh, you know that you guys know I collect um, shark covers. Uh, Legends of the Dark Knight number 19. I hope Batman has his shark repellent. Uh, Detective Comics 657. Right there. Looks like a Sam Keith cover. Uh, Blackest Night JSA number one. Pretty interesting cover. Uh, Detective Comics uh, 601. Batman 504. Right there. Uh, Avengers Annual number 14. Um, the War to End All Scrolls, I thought with all the Kree Skull and uh, Kotex or Kokakati or whatever the hell the plant people are called going on right now. Thought I'd grab that. Alpha Flight, I am trying to complete this run. I only got a few left. Found some of those. Alpha Flight 111, 110, 109. Flip some of these over because they are now backwards. Uh, Batman and Robin number six. Birds of Prey 122. I found another uh, Warrior Nun book. Ariella Angel of War. Right there. I believe this is a Todd McFarlane cover. Uh, this is Invasion, book one. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe this is Todd McFarlane. Found that uh, Ren and Stimpy issue where Spider-Man appears, uh, number six. Grab that. Found another Deathstroke I don't have, and it's number 14. Uh, picked up this Iron Man, 238. Again, these were all a buck. Uh, Wolverine, number 42. And number 20, Daredevil uh, 229, 293, 
Punisher in 292. Flash number 81. Got some speaking of Cat Ren figures. Uh, Starfire right there. She loves her Starfire. Uh, you guys know I love my skulls on my comic books. Um, Action Comics. This is 631. I might already have this. I don't know. Uh, Aquaman. There's a shark on here. 22. Right there. Dark Avengers. Number 178. Avengers 298. A lot of books. Going on 11 minutes here. All-Star Squadron. Number 50. I don't know why I picked grab this, but I did. There. Avengers Academy 21. This might be a first appearance of somebody. I'm not too sure. Um, whatever. Uh, Armorines from Valiant number one. Not sure if I have this. I collect all these Valiant books trying to get the runs of the 90s series just in case. Um,. Yeah, so Armorine's number one. I love this cover. This is uh, 68 Rule of War, number one, by Image. Love that cover. If you know anything about any of these books, like, oh my God, Grandpa, you got a $1,000 book, let me know, because I don't fucking know. Uh, 666, The Mark of the Beast. Um, pretty cool cover. Had to grab that. Uh, Avengers number five. There, I believe that's the Red Skull. I could be wrong. Um, but I grabbed it. Another shark cover. Aquaman from the New 52. Uh, 28. Another Aquaman shark cover. Number 31. Another Aquaman, number 20, featuring Aqua Girl. Got some meat and potatoes under the sea there. Throw some barbecue sauce on that. Getting down to the uh, last bit of books here. Another Alpha Flight, 124. Uh, really cool dolphin cover. Aquaman, number 18. I thought this was a key. I, again, I could be wrong. I'm not keen on my DC keys uh, it's probably not but uh, Adventures of S uh, Superman number 518 so Alpha Flight 81 and the last book Alpha Flight 107 that is it guys we're running at 13 minutes thank you all for watching come check us out on Blasted or Stash It where we'll be checking out some of those uh, new books I got signs ready for the show. That's our new thing. I like to hold up signs saying stupid shit. Um, it's kind of a um, uh, going well for that. Um, that's it. Uh, thank you all for watching. Be safe out there with all the bullshit going on. And uh, I'll catch you next time. Be kind to one another.